Hello and welcome back to another episode of War Tales. My name is Saiken and today we're exploring Arthur's tomb, uh, which is the last bit that we needed to do here in the county of Arthur's. I am excited to do that, quite literally and figuratively. So off we go into another tome. I wanted to go back down and look for my friends, but my leg, oh barely move and it starts my leg feels much better thank you can i come with you sure you gain one torch and support from a newfound friend clenilla and of course it doesn't take long until the creepers are creeping in And I wonder, by the way, first of all, um, it takes a very long time to load. There we go, finally. I wonder, uh, Clinilla, unfortunately, is an important NPC, so we can't just sacrifice her or uh, go too easy uh, with her. I really don't like the positioning here. Good, let's start with Miss Grell. Who slowly but surely begins to move. Stays around the light. And unfortunately, we can't detect anything, so we're just going to end the turn. More rats. All right, Jim moves over here. And gets rid of one of those more rats. Diddy moves over here. Oh, we got that new extraordinarily good bow. Problem is, we're not seeing anyone. Yeah, the light or the leg thereof actually is a problem. Moving to here. Getting some Valor. Those more reds are not a problem at all. The bigger problem is when the creepers are uh, turning up. But maybe that's not a problem. And we're just going to kill all of them before that happens. Good, back into the light. And there we go, of course. It was just a matter of time until the creepers are going to join. But one crit later, and I think we're okay.
Wow. She's dealing a lot of damage now. Good, moving up. And I like the new tank specs, they are getting so many valuable Valor points. Uh, can't we just get this guy? Apparently not. I thought we had shackles with us, chains, yeah. But maybe we're no longer allowed to capture them. Anyways, we come in and well, we can already see there is a golden key missing. Let's inspect this statue. The inscription reads, Erkirsch known as the Builder. Great to meet you, my dude. Question is, what is he building? We're continuing our exploration. We came from here. Two gem, uh, gems uh, glimmer at the monster's eye sockers. Taking them should be child's play. Gained a ruby. We gained a sapphire. What is it always with these statues? Every time this unit kills an enemy, they generate one extra morale. Is this your morale? No, that's happiness. What is morale? Let's give that to Andrew Sanders. I want to understand what morale does. Nice trinket nonetheless. This door mechanism must be triggered from the other side, so... It seems we have come to an abrupt end on the side here. Unless there is something else. It's just a statue at this point. Good, moving back. Still no golden key, but we can explore further. You can see a room below, several meters under your feet. A python has been driven into the edge. Uh, let's use a rope. Cool. Backpack accessory generates a small amount of knowledge experience for each rest. Okay. Um, I think that's not too bad for you. Or is there anyone else? Ah, uh, well, you know, by thinking about it, it might actually be our blacksmith that could use it uh, the most. Slowly but surely leveling. Good. We got the red sign here. Double uh, triangle. And I think nothing else comes to mind. Let's explore further. Sounds like an ambush.
Let's try to pick that lock. Slowly, very slowly getting better at the at the pickpocket game. At the end of their turn, this unit has a 5% chance to generate uh, a Valor belt accessory. Is that worth it though? 5% isn't a lot. versus straight up 10% shooting attack damage. And the front line needs their belt accessories. No, I think it's not worth it. Although it's an interesting one, I'll definitely keep it. Who knows, maybe it is one of uh, a super good uh, trinket and I'm just not seeing the use. 5% can be quite deceiving. Uh, mm, yes, I know XCOM teaches you 5% happens all the time, but believe me, it doesn't. Okay, nothing here. No signs, nothing. Let's explore further. knowledge every time this unit engages in combat they have a chance to apply blackout only usable in good weather mm -hmm. that might actually be a really good trinket they have a chance to apply blackout which means enemy unit is missing 50% I will keep that in mind and we'll test it. Equally, we just got a knowledge point, which I want to upgrade our, our camp so bad. Cooking is definitely one of the things that I want to go next but strategy table two is taking priority because the strategy so far uh, the strategy table was just hilariously good okay i will do that real quick and be right back there we go we discovered the next rune little rune puzzles here This also strikes me as a room. Yep, there we go. So yellow S and the triangles from red. This here should be in, in the direction of the blocking door. Codex, the golden key. Not sure if uh, that was the key that we had been looking for beforehand. And there is uh, the blue window, blue window, um, red triangles and the yellow S. Anything that I'm missing here? This looks important, but apparently it is not. Proceed cautiously. Yes, please.
that's a lord of the reference ring right there i like it the well then you hear the click 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 and the drum uh drums the orcs are coming in this case there uh the creepers are coming well played game well played you got me there Good memory starts here. That's a shitty position to start in. They are really good at finding positions that you don't want to start in. Okay, well... Carefully moving forward, nothing, 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 and a lot of nothing, and we're ending the turn. Well, there we go, creepers. That worked like a charm. Moving back into the light. That's the one thing I learned. Always stay in the light here. Okay, let the bear go around. With the result of not finding anyone, apparently we're being attacked from that side. Okay, fair enough. Problem with our archers is we can't even attack anyone because we don't see anything wasting a lot of turns here just to get everybody in position before we're then sprinting back. Okay, a couple more more rats. But yeah, we can't even hit them because we don't see them. Disappointing. Again, can't see them. Oh, this is ridiculous. Good, we're moving back. And that is that.
No, no, why, why did I end the turn? I wanted to execute uh, that strike, but space is ending the turn. Well, never mind then. Jim moves up and penetrates that guy. Nice little hit for bleeding, and there is the kill. Good. Let's kill some more reds. I hope that that will be enough to finish the scenario. There was a morale. I just don't know what that means. Straight up kill into another kill. Very good. Our new specs are fantastic. I love them. We're taking those four with us as well. Thank you. This whole room is just here in order to make you cringe. So, let's see if I remember correctly. Uh, I know it's yes, and I know it's those two... But I'm missing... I think it was this one. Good, and that should be the center of the room. There is always an end fight so far, and then you can kind of salvage the tome. Maybe not this time. Maybe it is indeed different. Good, we're going in deeper. I like these explorations. Absolute, absolutely well done. Fortunately, the creepers make it a bit creepy. Good, this time we can cluster up. I really like that positioning much more. Let's use the bear as our scout, shall we?
Interesting. More reds are coming to this position. Hmm. Well, I tell you what. Let's get this party started. We know additional ones are coming from the right hand side. Miss Grell tries to move a little bit closer. But of course, the rat takes our archer. Good. And so far, that's a relatively easy fight. But part of it is also because the reds are just not very difficult. Okay, we could move up. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's just finish this. Not sure what this morale is doing. can't fully get there but we can do that and that handing over orderly good that gives us enough ve valor to easily end, end this Yeah, and we captured one of them. Fun fact. Okay, we're taking our bear, moving him to the front line. could really use some more torches. The two torches are making it way more serviceable than the one that we had beforehand. Can we use Wrath? No, because the Wrath still has too many hit points. Unfortunate.
Can't even get there. <laughs> Lol. Uh, Jim, please redeem us. Darkness is a really, really scary concept here. Rage damage dealers, absolute utter garbage in darkness. But we got Parrot here. And Parrot uh, is incorrectly named. Has been renamed Pervert and the com uh, uh, companions approve. Love it. Very good. All right. Let's get that sweet, sweet loot. Which we were waiting for. There we go, treasure of the ancients. That's what I'm talking about. Got the town rune. Anything else in this particular room? I think that was a really, really good dungeon. By the way, pervert. Um Constitution reduced in, uh, by half. Let's give him a flawed remedy. Didn't work. Try again. Come on. Can't be that difficult. This is where we part ways, mercenaries. Thank you for helping me look for my friends. Though I wish we'd found them alive. I hope this present will help you in your adventures. I pray that they will be met with more success than ours. Backpack accessories also earn one influence when profession experience is gained. Okay, well, that's not bad. It's definitely better than nothing uh generate a small amount of knowledge that's better profession experience gained by the troop increased by five percent yeah, that one is fantastic. And we do have some more research to do over the next few days. As you can see, we got the treasure of the ancients right there. And this time, my good friend, you are not going to escape us. We're putting him over here. Not going to be as nice as I was with Enkiv, because Enkiv really had uh, almost our trust. On the other hand... Hmm. Hmm. Let's see if uh, that will reduce his, uh, his morale. Good. Also, in terms of upgrades, strate strategic table uh, two star requires more wood. I will get that. And that will unlock the additional strategies. We have plenty of backpack accessories and a lot of other uh, things to go through. Codex management, I need to understand the new border uh, uh, codices. In the meantime, I think if I'm just looking at the larger picture here, guys. Hanover Prisoner. Uh, 
uh, Tiltron is done. Yeah, we could kill some more bandits. Okay, fair enough. But I think we're more or less done in in uh, in that prov uh, province, which tells me we either go to Herak border uh, crossing. That's one option. Or Dornbach, or Gosenberg. Oh, difficult one. I'll figure it out and you will see it in the next episode. This one uh, was a good one. I truly appreciate uh, the uh, tomb uh, raiding. That's one of my favorite uh, parts about the game. Really, really fun. Uh, next time we're uh, very likely going to go into a new and unexplored region and are going to rock the boat there thanks for watching guys if you enjoyed what you've seen consider liking and subscribing and see you in the next episode bye bye